Click on the subscribe button, especially the bell on the right side, otherwise you will miss the latest videos. Uh, hello everyone, after circular chat, I would like to talk about a very interesting topic which is artificial intelligence and uh, how can it impact or how will artificial impa impact the world of astrology. So my, the, uh, what I want to talk briefly about is artificial intelligence intelligence in astrology right so it's a very new topic uh, most of us heard about artificial intelligence when everybody started talking about ad gpt ai and uh, some of us got very excited some of us got very distracted right so in the last few months what happened is the world has changed right the market is flooded with software which are artificially intelligent the market is of software which claim to be artificial intelligence, artificial intelligence. Everybody is talking about artificial intelligence today. And uh, we all know this happened because of Chat GPT, which was launched in November of 2022. So in November of 2022, Chat GPT came into existence. And then after a few months, it became like a household name. So now everybody talks about artificial intelligence and artificial intelligence, Chat GPT and Everybody, almost everybody, every company in technology business is investing in artificial intelligence, right? The, the artificial intelligence becomes so much important and uh, it, it kind of caught everybody's attention so much so that the CEO of NVIDIA, Jensen Huang, said generative AI products like ChatGPT mark an inflection point in AI. So inflection point, we all know the point of no return, the point wherein things will become exponentially important, the point at which things will take a very different path, right? So, so the AI will become mainstream in the coming future, right? We know the AI is transformative and it is going to change everything around us. It will change everything around us and uh, there is a lot of excitement around it there are, the, there are also a lot of fears around ai right like any other new thing so we there are obviously fears around it there are anxieties around it there are discomforts around it and one of the common fear that all of us have regarding ai is will ai replace humans and guess what this is going to happen. Will it change the world of astrology? Will AI change the world of astrology? And the answer is yes. And let me show you how it will change the world of astrology. So what I have for you is two proof of concept what AI can do in astrology. And I, I, I want you to understand that these are proof of concepts these are not full fledged softwares but these are softwares which are just here to prove a point to prove a concept right so let me give you quick demos of these tools uh, so that yes. we So the first tool I have for you is the chatbot. If you have logged into Saprishi's app, you will find this chatbot, which is which I call it as 7R bot. 7R for Saprishi's. So this is 7R bot. Now, let me show you what it can do for you. Let's say I am a beginner. I do not know about astrology. Right? So I will ask this chatbot. What is Rashi? So this chatbot 
which is a artificially intelligent chatbot it understands the natural language it, it does nlp nlu neural networks everything about ai and then it gives you a simple answer rashi means heap in sanskrit it means collection of things each rashi or sign means a lot of things now again i i don't want to read out what it is giving but what i'm here to show you is what ai can do in the world of astrology so this is again this is at a very nascent stage i i have trained this bot for like hundreds of use cases probably roughly around 100 questions it can answer it cannot answer everything for you but this is the future this is where we are going to invest our time and energy we are going to build this bot so that it is making astrology easier for all of us we all have lot of questions around ai we all have questions around astrology and this is a bot which can help you answer some of the basic fundamental questions about astrology so this is my use case number 1 this is my one of the tools one of the software one of the proof of concepts what ai can do to the world of astrology now let me tell you another let me take you through another example so i i ask you this question will ai replace humans and then i also told you the answer is yes whether you like it or hate it can ai replace astrologers let me show you how so you come to this website jorpandit.com and you will find a similar icon here at the right bottom of the screen or if you want you can also do you can also click on your pandit so once you click on this chat it takes you to this screen which is telling you welcome to your pandit chat and it's a beta it's a it's in beta stage i'm an astrology chatbot and i can answer some I questions see. based on vedic astrology for you think of me like a virtual astrologer i am still learning right now let me show you somebody asked about somebody asked this question uh, when i was listening how can astrology determine the life purpose so let me ask this chatbot So I asked this question, "What is my life purpose?" And then the answer I got it: You should develop emotional intelligence, learn to love unconditionally, provide shelter and nourishment to others. You will find inner happiness when you are caring for others, playing with children, taking care of others like mother. So again, it is telling me what is the purpose of my life, what gives me the inner peace or happiness, right? Likewise, it can. and give you answers to lot of these questions like if you want to know most important years of my life can i ask one small question i'll i'll come to it so if you if you want to type in most important years of my life it is telling you okay these are your fortunate years in the life start date end date likewise it is okay like an astrologer okay it is talking to you as a virtual astrologer it is not a astrologer it is a software driven by artificial intelligence right so ai has lot of potential what it can do to us to the humanity and what it can do for as as a astrologer as as somebody who is a learner in astrology is what i've demonstrated to you like any other change there two arms either we can adopt the change or we can fight the change right yeah, the only 
two options we can either adopt with the change adopt the change yeah, or we can find the change ha yeah, drawing the room is yours with that i will take a pause and i will open up for any questions uh, is this based on birth details yes it is based on birth details okay okay thank you it is based on birth details it takes into account all the vedic astrology calculations it takes into account your birth details it can it takes into account your panchang it looks at your positions of the planet it, it, it looks into various factors like any other astrologers will do right you can give complete predictions also it can it, give it, it, will, it will give some predictions i'm not saying the uh -huh. bot is ready okay, okay it is in a very it is in the beta stage right, right. so it can do oh. certain things but it cannot do everything for you but over the years over the over the months to come uh, you will see much better version of it and we will continue to improve and improvise these uh, this is a very new tool very new technology uh, this is all evolving this is all happening as as we speak right so the world is changing around us ai will change the way we live we uh, uh, so so all all of this is going to change so so just hold on just just uh, understand that this is at a very basic stage it will not answer you but it it is telling you how the world will change for us as the astrologers thank you thank you so very much i see more hands raised uh, maybe abhishek uh, if you want to go uh, yes sir uh, good afternoon sir uh, thanks a lot for the wonderful presentation and also uh, throwing some light on the changing dimensions and the paradigms into the new technology and also like how exactly the world is evolving and how exactly the human life would be in the future years to come but i still have an apprehension that uh, what will be the level of acceptability acceptability of the people in the astrological sector in other sectors is okay when it comes to ai because uh, i'll tell you something uh, like very common uh, in india as well as outside of india people sometimes still say that oh you make our charts based on the softwares how reliable are those why don't you make by the hand the traditional system which existed in india in the vedic astrology so sometimes people don't accept it wholeheartedly you know although they accept it with time because now everything works on computer on ai on systems so they accept it eventually but still people question it this is what i just i am very curious to know yeah people will question people will continue to question so there are there will there will always be believers there will always be non believers and you have to live with both right so people initially uh, as you rightly said so people will question like why are you calculating with computers why are you not preparing a birth chart using your hand or looking at the panchang the way the older astrologers used to do right so all these things will happen but why why ai becomes important is one today one of the thing one of the challenges which i have seen with astrology community is everybody and ev anybody and everybody will start calling themselves as astrologer whether they have any basic skills of astrology whether they don't have they will all start calling themselves astrologers and what happens because of that is they will give any left right center they will give any any kind of prediction to anybody i mean without looking at without knowing the basics of astrology now let me tell you one thing the software is going to be better than many many astrologers i am not saying that it will replace humans outrightly it cannot replace because there is a intuition which is involved and there is there are so many factors to consider before you reach to a prediction right but what it will do is it will remove that layer of fake astrologers because it is going to give predictions which are much much better it, it is definitely not going to replace like the good quality astrologers because you are talking about years and years of learning right so 
for a for somebody to learn astrology it takes like a lifetime lifetime is even not enough to learn and master astrology right so you will have to live like two three lifetimes to be able to learn and understand everything and everything about astrology right so you you cannot train machines to do what a good quality astrologer which is like probably like 0.1% of all astrologers or probably 0.001% of all astrologers in the world what they can do machines cannot do but can it predict better than ordinary astrologer probably yes okay so you mean to say that the astrologers won't become obsolete as such they will still uh, continue to exist because the knowledge is uh, knowledge is also an evolving phenomena yes Oh, but some of some of the astrologers which are like uh, they uh, if somebody is on a very weak ground somebody has no knowledge because the software will give you good quality predictions to a certain extent so so i mean it, it will probably not meet like the top of the best of the best astrologers but it will meet or at least to like you, you so so let me let me tell you uh, let me answer you this way in 1997 deep blue defeated gary kasparov in chess that was 1997 so machines can do wonders right but with the right training with the right amount of investment if it can beat the grand master in chess da da gary kasparov in 1997 it can do a lot of things in the world of astrology too can it replace all chess players no right so likewise it cannot replace each and every astrologer but it will it will definitely change the way how astrology and astrology community operates today thanks a lot sir astrologers will become lazy <laughs> astrologers will become lazy without reading books also they buy a software and they open a shop hello yes sir the last part you have uh, told about ai ai i have not uh, attend the class sir please repeat very quickly about ai artificial intelligence is going to transform we live our lives today yes and what i have demonstrated is two proof of concept how and what astrology what ai can do in the world of astrology so one of the chatbot talks about different queries that you may have as an astrologer or learner learner of astrology and other is the chatbot which can talk to you like a virtual astrologer so these two things i have demonstrated to you again these are proof of concepts these are not fully functional softwares but they are evolving softwares this is this is just to demonstrate to you that what ai can do in the world of astrology it is not a full product right now but in the months to come these tools will become more intelligent and they will become more robust and they will be able to handle some of these tasks with much much uh, great clarity and much more greater inputs is is there any ai tool available now today sir or are you discovering any demonstrated two of the tools um, yes, i do not know if anybody else is working on this thing right now but ai in astrology is what i demonstrated just now maybe you can watch the recording later no oh, sir yes okay do we have any other questions rao sir you have something okay if not then thank you so much everyone uh, thanks for uh, thanks for attending this session uh, sunil sir
Thank you very much for the nice informative session. Thank you. Thank you, Vidhan. It was really a pleasure uh, knowing so much from you uh, from the other part of the world. And it is uh, outstanding. And uh, thank you so much for contributing towards astrology and for people like us who don't live in India and we learn so much from people like you. Thank you so much once again. Thank you. You are so kind. Thanks a lot. Very nice. Excellent. Mm -hmm.